We uh, joined up with Enforcement Division to um, do some surveys of the uh, lower end of the Chandelier Islands and Breton Islands. Um, we're basically looking for oral wildlife or deceased wildlife and um, if we come upon any of that we'll, we'll process that for the response. Um, deceased wildlife will be collected, identified, um, tagged and, and brought into the response uh, center in Venice for, um, for processing and uh, injured wildlife if it's something we're able to capture we'll do that and, and bring it on board and, and forward that get that shuttle back to the uh, rehab center so for, for rehab. Um, my primary job is to observe the wildlife. If we do document or notice any oil wildlife, we'll call those coordinates in and, and that description into the command center in Homa where they can either dispatch additional personnel and the proper equipment or aircraft to, uh, to come in and try to assist us in, in picking that up. The facility is set up to triage and uh, treat all wildlife that's rescued out in our marshes and waterways. It's fully equipped, it's got a laboratory, it's got uh, washing facilities for the, the birds and the wildlife, it's got pens set up to be able to contain them while they're being fed, it's got outdoor pools set up so that they can swim and, and get fully rehabbed before they're released wildlife that is oiled uh, typically does not eat very well they get or drink well they get dehydrated that's the biggest problem they get yeah, so those birds are brought in stabilized once they're stabilized with fluids and nutrition then they're washed to remove the oil and they may be washed several days in a row if necessary uh, once they're back eating and drinking on their own they're put out in the rehab pens where they can move around once they're obtaining food on their own and preening their feathers then they can can be released. The facility has been here for two weeks set up and, and it's been an ongoing process getting the, all of the pens built and, and everything in place and as it stands today everything's ready to roll if we get a bunch of birds in.